response right there. So Dan and I are here at uh, Irwindale at the burn yard. It's, it's got a breeze right now. Nice. It's got a decent breeze. Yeah, it's really nice. It's starting to cool off. I went sleeveless for this. You went for sleeves? Yeah. No sleeves. No sleeves. Delete. The sleeve delete. Sleeve delete. Still I wearing got, denim. I got some scary skinny legs and white. <laughs> <laughs> let's just not think about that, right? Okay, let's not think about your skinny chicken legs. Are you guys let's just talk about what we would think about when we were little kids, which is something you dream about, which is a car like this. Oh, this car over here? This car over here. This car's bananas. to bring you a special report. When we started this, like what, two and a half years ago? There was one simple rule. Don't leave the donut garage. Don't leave the yard. So we're making a show about leaving the yard. It's that simple. Very Hoonigan show, it starts next week. Watch it, Mondays, Wednesdays, maybe Fridays, 9 a.m. main channel. Well, it better be sick. Daily transmission of the future. I haven't seen any of that. Our is first episode is you. Yeah, is you're in sick? the first episode. Is it sick? I don't know, I wasn't there, is it sick? I don't know. Oh, I was under my car the whole time. <laughs> oh. Well, anyway. <laughs> A lot more of the same old thing with a whole new name. Enjoy. We made it to Mexico! I wanted to check out this car. It came to the donut garage the other day and uh, I want to see it. What's going on, man? Hello, day in paradise, my friend. Nice. <laughs> What's up, man? Living Who are you? Yeah. What the hell did you bring here? Uh, Brian King's my name. Uh, this is my 82 Olds Cutlass. It's a, my all wheel drive animal. Oh, it's an 82 Cutlass yeah. that's all wheel drive? Yeah. That's not factory. No, no, not at all. Custom made. So it took a lot of work to do it. Well, we met you the other day, yeah. for starters. He drove this from Nebraska. Yeah. Wait a minute, you drove from Nebraska. One, it's an 82 cutlass and it's four-wheel drive. Four-wheel drive. And you just Nebraska. drove it. Yep, 1,600 miles straight here. He doesn't even want to talk. He's like, let's just go right into it. show you. Picture's worth a thousand words. Oh, boy. Wow. Yeah, I like how you got to have the flex right off the bat. Yeah, <laughs> right there. So we got going on? Well, we got a 427 LSX uh, engine oh, from Texas Speed Performance. Oh, okay. Uh, Pro Charger, uh, it's a F1X. And oh, boy. It's right around 22 pounds of boost. Oh wow, so this thing ain't playing games. No. <laughs> How much power does this put down? Well, I haven't dynoed yet. I got don't, you're just not telling us, no, are you? I, I haven't, I can't tell you. <laughs> ah, I, see? I'd love to brag about it, but I don't have any numbers yet, so. 427 on 22 pounds of boost. What do we got going on? I mean, you guys yeah. Yeah. Carbon yeah. Thousand? yeah. Yeah, we'll go 40,000. No. It's, I see uh, a carbon fiber. Maybe about a thousand horse, maybe. Oh, yeah. a thousand. You know, at the wheel, maybe. Oh. You got a lot of carbon fiber. That's yeah. You. you make this? I made everything, yep. All the carbon myself. Uh, the hood's also carbon. Yeah, so you laid the, the hood also. Yep. Made the hood. Dude! Rotor, all the interior, carbon ceramic uh, rotors as well. Tried to lighten in the car as much as I could. Nice. What does it weigh? Uh, it was right around 3,700 pounds before all the carbon fiber work, so I'm guessing I probably knocked off another 400 pounds roughly. Nice. <laughs> what do you do that you just yeah. learned how to do carbon fiber? Uh, I'm actually uh, kind of a body guy. Pop okay. dents for a living, uh, a little paint work here and there. Turn wrenches, I've kind of in cars since I was like 13, so. Just so, kind of second nature, I guess. All right, well, the question on hmm. my mind is, how do you make this all-wheel drive? Uh, I used a Olds Bravada on the front part of the frame, and then I kept the cutlass frame in the back, married the two frames together, and just a lot of a lot of finessing with the metal, I guess. An Oldsmobile Bravada? <laughs> Bravada, yeah. Just, oh, put that in. That's a very it's bizarre automobile. Ever. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but same. it's like an S10 Blazer. It's yeah, same, yeah, same yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the all-wheel drive system itself. That, that's actually out of a uh, 2007 SS Trailblazer. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Cool, yeah, I get it now. That's sick. <laughs> kind of parts so the frame's <laughs> modified with Bravada. <laughs> right, yeah. And the all-wheel drive system itself is from a pretty beefy, pretty decent beefy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Trailblazer yeah. NSS. Is... Oh yeah, I see the differential hmm. right here. I mean, it doesn't look like there's a uh, surplus of space here. Oh, it's tight. So it still runs a steering box. 
not a rack and pinion. Yeah. And then what else? What else is special on the front? QA1 coilovers. I guess that's probably the major thing for other changes. Is this How carbon did... fiber pipe or is this wrapped? It's wrapped, aluminum. but okay. it's, it's three layers of uh, carbon over the aluminum. Okay. Inside, I saw the dash. Yep, that's all carbon yep. fiber as well. Door cards. Everything. Yep. Everything. Ooh, here's the big thing though. It's got lightning rods. What is that? What? I know what they are. Yeah, okay. Explain to the people. You know what lightning rods <laughs> yeah, are? Yeah, yeah. Okay. A lot of people don't know what lightning rods are. You can explain it then. Okay, the shifter closest to you controls your park, reverse, neutral, overdrive, drive, and the middle stick goes from the 3 2 shift, and the one farthest away goes from the 2 1. So then you pop it forward. It's something fancy. Fun. It's a street Lenko from back in the day. Yeah. This came with, th these came with this. This one didn't. This one did. This but they did, this was a, on certain uh, models. Olds. Yeah, you would actually get it. But that's still really rad. They're rare, but they're cool. Yeah. Oh, we got a supercharged LS aficionado who had to creep out of the woodwork oh, for this. I wish I had all-wheel drive LS. That is sick. And it's got a... Oh. He built it in two weeks. It's a pro charger. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's actually this carbon fiber, which I didn't even notice. I like how it looks like you painted or like... Yeah, it tinted put the clear. Tinted the clear on the yeah. carbon, because you could hardly even notice yeah. it. That's sick. I looked at this the other day and I didn't notice until just now. So what'd you build this thing for? Yeah. Just for fun? It's my first car. I've had it since 94. It was first just a $400 pile of crap back in the day. And over the years, I just kept tweaking it out. Here it is today. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's awesome. That's quite Decades a Decades later. <laughs> what do you got going on for, so we, what transmission was it? That's a 4L70. 4L70 and then you add that to it? Uh, the, the shifters? Case on yeah, it was already on there because the whole, the whole drive plant came out of the SS Trailblazer. That was the engine transmission and transmission okay. case. And that's obviously a manual valve body so that you can use that type no, of shift? The valve body's still standard, I think. Huh. So it'll shift itself automatically yep. or you could use the, the shifters? Interesting. Lightning rods, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No. Lightning rods. It's nice. Did, did you build it up at all, like the transmission? Yeah, it's fully built. Because this has a hard, hard horsepower. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty wild, yeah. <laughs> He's not telling how much, though. What? He says like 300. That's a bunch of crap. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything in the back? You got a 12 volt or? Nope, still the original uh, rear end to the Cutlass. Uh, I put uh, different gears in it. What uh, gears? Motion yeah. axles, I got 411s in four it. 411s. Ah. But the nice thing about that transfer case, it splits your power 50 50. Right. Plus each differential seat's about half the weight of the vehicle. It's nice. How would you ride from Nebraska to here? In a kirky. His back yeah, is steel. <laughs> that's some man. No, they're not bad. That's some man yeah, shit. Yeah, that's there. commitment. That's yeah, some man shit. I would never. Carbon ceramic brakes. What are those off of? That's the smallest wheel you could fit on yeah, his brake. Yeah. If you look, it's about two millimeters clearance between the rim and the caliper. It's tight, tight. Oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's all you need. All right, well, what about gravel? This is what screwed there. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> gravel is I like that you can see up in there, and that's all carbon caliper and stuff. It's different to see it from the top than the bottom, and you can see like how it's laid out. So cool, yeah. Yeah, it's amazing. So, is the original paint on this? No, it was actually like a brown color before, but oh. the paint's already 13 years old on it. So, oh, it looks really good. Is so, your daily? Yep, pretty much. It's the only hot rod I got. We'll pick up in this. So, have you ran this thing down the strip? Uh, a couple years ago, I did. It was a 960 to 139 before I blew the motor up, which now I've got a whole different setup. <laughs> 960. <laughs> Four thousand pound cars. What kind of sixty foot can you cut uh, on this suspension? It's got to be great. I can show you this. Oh, let's you let's want. look at that because I'm really curious yeah, to know what your sixty foot is. One five. One it was five? and it was it was spinning the tires a little bit, but like I said, it was a whole different car then. Yeah, and this was a couple years ago. <laughs> yeah. You roll yeah. up with this thing, nobody's gonna think that this thing's fast. I well, mean, until you open unless it. you look I don't at the know. you look at the brakes and you hear the whine. But yeah. like, let's listen to it. Yeah. And make our assessment. From that. Yeah. Can you fire it up? Yeah. You guys roll it Yeah. Yeah. Oh! oh my god! Damn! That's a spicy! That's spicy! <laughs> the bypass valve? Yeah! Fire smoke off of the ground. Yeah. <laughs> and why you. Yeah. Wow. Rob, That's you approve? I approve for sure. Yeah. It sounds pretty unassuming. Yeah. Until you give it some noise. And then yeah. Woo. I want to see a couple of launches. Yeah, we need to launch this thing, for sure. We need to definitely see that. Absolutely. Woo! This thing sounds good. We're good. Go ahead and launch. Holy shit! God damn!
<laughs> Dude! Whoa! He's gone! He's gone! He didn't even stall it or nothing, he just left! Did that thing lay tracks all Yeah! The Dude, look at it! If he did that, if he let me drive that, I would have done the same thing. Out yeah. the freeway. You're Stop. not stopping it. That's mine now. Yeah. Dang, that thing rips. That thing's badass. Never coming back. <laughs> you didn't even put it on stall, you just left. Just left it. <laughs> Alright, line it up and do it again. This Boy. thing's bananas! That thing eats. Woo! That thing is bananas. It's so fast. Yeah. It keeps pulling too. Yeah. I'm in. It's unreal. You got, you have to, it feels crazy. It looks like it's doing a wheelie for like a quarter mile. Oh shit. Oh, that's fast. <laughs> <laughs> and he's threading a needle through there too. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. If it ever steps out. He said he went 44 miles an hour right here. 44 miles an hour. <laughs> 44 miles an hour. Fuck. Yo, it's on pump gas. Hang on, hang on. 91. Hey. Wait. Wait. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> I love that car. I wish I could buy it from him. But there's something you, you can't. You can't buy that. You can't buy that no. car. How's your head? Can you do one more? Yeah, you gotta get, you gotta get one more. Okay. Sick. Yo, that's <laughs> it. It's fast. <laughs> Have fun, Johnny boy! Oh, that was the launch right there. Man, that thing is bad. Those tires are getting stickier. <laughs> that Ooh, was the launch. Boy. Hold on, I'm gonna go see if I can find a Trailblazer SS. Right you find now. a Trailblazer, I'll look for a G body. <laughs> we'll just let's build Push one. Them together. All right. That's all we need. That was a good launch there. That was sick. <laughs> What'd you think, John? That is bad. That's a good time. That's, That's a, good a time. real good that time thing, right there. That throws you back. This, this is, is such a cool creation. Cool, yeah, it's sick. I'm like glad. It's a nine second car, so it's not the fastest car in the world, but it's just, it's super rad. The way it launches just feels like uh, so unique. Yeah. That was nine seconds on the old one. Yeah, 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 yeah. We don't even know now. Well, Texas Speed said it's built for 1600. Oh, so now he's dropping numbers now. Yeah, they said it's built for that. I don't know if it's quite <laughs> not there or whatever, but yeah. I don't know. It feels faster it than feels, mostly yeah. anything. Four wheel so. drive cars launching is amazing. Yes, dude. So much amazing. <laughs> that just got after it. Yeah. I'm glad you got to come out because we excited. wanted to see yeah. all the hard work you put into this. This thing's amazing. Yeah, this is sick, man. Oh, we got to experience it. Thanks for taking all three of us for a ride, man. That, was, time, man. that was super cool. We only got one more thing left to do. That's a wrap! So good. Line of straight cut gear. <laughs> <laughs>